Hey everyone, it's me again. It's Tati and today I am bringing a 360 wig hair review. So I ordered this from Ruyu Hair, R-U-I-Y-U Hair. And this is an 18 inch Malaysian deep wave. I'm not sure you can see it and I can't really do much. I love this hair. This hair came in nice and it came with quick delivery. The delivery only took like three days because I ordered it on the 7th and I got on the 10th. But not to mention I have like a full week and a half almost with this hair and I've seen like little to zero shedding because it's, I'm quite impressed with the hair. This is my very first 360 wig. As others would do, they would order a pre-plucked wig, but I did not. So I thought this wig was going to come in pre-plucked, but I was deceived. <laughs> I had to take my day and like three to four hours pluck this hair and make like the baby hairs and everything. And I had no idea, so I had to sit like on like YouTube as you're sitting right now and look at other videos and like learn how to pluck a wig. I am only a lace part wig wearer. I only wear lace part wigs. So I like I just switch the wig whenever the whatever way I want it. I'm not really a 360 wig commissioner or whatever it is. Like I'm not an expert with this. I had to sit down and search how to do this. But I am very impressed and I'm very happy with this wig because this is like a week and a half with it and I am no shedding almost and the hair is currently dry right now, it has some mousse and leave-in so the curls can stay tamed down. It's actually pretty poofy when you get it. I first got it, I got it inside this box. <clears throat> got it inside this box. If I sound sick, please don't mind it. I'm like, the flu hit me hard, so I'm like recording. When it first came in all honesty, I was gonna cry because I thought they ripped me off and I'm like, oh my god, so like the box is mad small and watch my wig be mad skin. When I got it, I'm like, oh, it was just very well folded. And it was pretty long, it was pretty soft, silky, still silky, so what am I talking about? The first thing first I did, it kind of had like this weird smell, so the first thing I did was wash it with warm water and condition it. And then I just put it in my little mannequin and stuff and I just pinned it down and I just plucked it. It took me about like three hours exact to get the way I wanted my hairline, my style. The density of this wig is 150, so like it's like a regular density. I don't want it too thick or too thin, so I got like the ideal density. It's 18 inches long as I mentioned previously. A uh, hair color, it was supposed to be a 1B when I saw it on the website, but it came out to be a 2, and I'm like low key disappointed because I don't know how to feel about I don't know how to feel about brown hair. Like I'm a like dark brown hair person, and I don't really do colors. I might dye the hair because I want like a different color, it's time for like a different me, kinda. There's not really a difference between the Brazilian and Malaysian, or Peruvian, but I got Malaysian, I don't know why. The part length is like up to like up here, I think, so it's like six and a half inches, so you have enough space to do whatever the heck as you please. The lace color is a light brown, so if you was to be, let's say, a little tinsy bit lighter than me you would have to bleach it if you're darker then you would have to bleach it too but for some odd reason it just blended right with my skin color so I was so happy when it did because I'm like oh my god like it just saved me time from bleaching hair I don't want to do that if you're the type of person who's like looking to have a regular wig without having to glue it down then this wouldn't be the ideal way although this has clips has four clips for all areas and it has an adjustable cap if you adjust it enough, it can be flat enough, but it wouldn't be the same when you glue it. I mean, it'll be laying flat. It'll look totally natural and like when you don't have it glued. So if you use got to be like the right way, it'll it'll be successful for you. The cap size, <clears throat> I think the cap size is just a regular size, like medium size. Like whoever has a small head would just adjust it to smaller. Whoever has a bigger head would just like adjust it bigger. But I'm medium, so I just left it how it is. I love this hair because this is like a week and a half, almost no shedding. I've washed it twice because since I put a lot of products on it for the curls, product build up, I tend to 
um, wash the hand keep it cleansed I would give this vendor a thumbs up so if you're planning on like getting your first wig and like you don't want to spend a whole lot of money like on other places on other websites then I would suggest this wig have to take your time to pluck it because the hairline comes in um, comes in like full like you have to pluck 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 because it's that's how much the density is when it's like it's like you know it has a lot of hair and I love it so I'm not even gonna complain but you would have to take your time and pluck it it comes in with baby hairs but you still have to take your time pluck those baby hairs and make it thinner and you know make it more natural looking I love it if you plan on getting this wig then I would suggest you do it thank you for watching and I hope you like this and if you're a new person watching this and subscribe see y'all later